Welcome back to another edition of Prototech Tips. Today we're going to take a look at using the Prototech Strategy Manager to help us process holds. Before we get started, let's take a quick look at our part. Here I've identified all the holes that need to be processed, including some quarter 20 tapped holes, a 1032 tapped hole, and two quarter inch ream holes. Okay, let's get started. I'm going to start by processing the quarter 20 holes on the top face. Ensure your WCS T plane and C plane are set correctly. Launch the strategy manager and select the appropriate strategy file and strategy. Import the strategy. Note how three toolpaths have been added to the toolpath manager. At this point, I can select the drill point locations. I can use my auto cursor or my auto cursor override. So I can simply select edges. The selected locations will be applied to the imported toolpaths. Okay, let's process the front of the part. The first step, make sure our WCS T plane and C plane are set correctly. Choose the appropriate strategy file and strategy. For the 1032 tap tool, I selected the bottom of the hole, just like when I did the quarter 20s. In this situation, using incremental depths relative to the bottom of the hole would be correct. Now I want to process the two quarter inch reamed holes. So I'm going to hit the New Strategy button, select a new strategy file, and Strategy. When I select the locations for the ream tools, I'm just going to select the top of the hole. Within the Strategy Manager, I can override the absolute and incremental depth setting, as well as manually enter depth values. I'm going to apply the depth changes. I've now completed processing all the holes. Well, that's it for today. Stay tuned for another edition of Prototech Tips.